Hi, I'm Dr. Bob Schaefer, head of research at Lumosity. People often ask me, does Lumosity work? What they're really asking is, what does Lumosity make me better at? Cognitive training is a rapidly growing field, so there are a lot of exciting open questions about the impact of brain training. But based on our own research and 10 years worth of data, we believe that Lumosity can improve your performance on a number of things. Each Lumosity game is designed to challenge a specific cognitive ability, like memory, attention, speed, flexibility, or problem solving. As you train on one game, we give you the tools and feedback to track your improvement on that game. As you get better at each game, you might be getting better at, for instance, the memory component within that specific game. Where it gets even more interesting is when training on one game actually impacts your performance on another game. We see clear evidence that training on one Lumosity game makes you better at other similar games. For example, training on the memory game Pinball Recall might make you better at another memory game, like Memory Matrix. We call this phenomenon transfer of learning, in this case between similar games. And we see that learning transfers one step farther as well. When you train on one Lumosity game, it can make you better at some other games that target different skills. For example, training on a speed game might make you better at an attention game. But we also see transfer of learning beyond Lumosity games. In a large published study, we showed how training on Lumosity games leads to improvements on the Neurocognitive Performance Test, or NCPT, a validated battery of cognitive assessments, the type that a neuropsychologist might use to measure your cognitive performance. And in addition to these improvements on assessments, we also showed that Lumosity training leads to improvements in some self-reported measures of concentration and mood. So, it's clear that Lumosity can do a lot of things that we can measure, and we're confident in these findings. They're based on in-depth analyses of large numbers of people from a range of ages and backgrounds. What about transfer of learning from Lumosity to your daily life? So this is an exciting but tough question for a couple reasons. First, there's not a lot of consensus in the field about the ideal way to measure impact on your daily life. What might be important for you might not matter to me, or it might be hard to get a consistent measurement for comparison across people of different ages and backgrounds. And second of all, there are big logistical challenges. Clinical trials are notoriously slow and expensive, but that doesn't mean we can't make inroads through focused research studies. For instance, some studies examine the real-world effects of brain training by looking at small populations, like how a specific form of attention training might affect older adults in particular. Other studies use cognitive assessments, like our NCPT, or other tests as proxies for real-world abilities. These studies have produced really promising results, and every single one of them helps add some additional understanding of what brain training can do. So for now, we're excited by what we know Lumosity can do, and we're committed to tackling the big open questions and discovering even more through further research.